In Mabel, Minnesota, you'll find the state's oldest functioning hotel, run by Crystal Atkins. Should we whistle while we work? <laughs> <laughs> who is also a full-time zoning administrator for Fillmore County. Crystal is another voter who switched to Donald Trump after voting for Barack Obama in her first two elections. With Fillmore County being such an agricultural, rural community, we have a lot, I have a lot of friends that are self-employed. They're farmers. They, they don't have... Um, day jobs, they don't work eight to five in an office, so they're all purchasing their own health insurance. And when I see what the Affordable Care Act has done for these people, there isn't a soul in the county that, that thinks it's affordable. But, you know, those were all things that factored into it. But um, the, the other thing about Fillmore County is there's a lot of hunters, there's a lot of strong Second Amendment folks. And I'm sick of hearing, oh, we've got to tighten up the, we've got to tighten up the regulations for purchasing firearms. Although she knew of some people in town who voted for Hillary Clinton, Crystal didn't think Clinton had what it took. I have lots of friends that, oh, they want to see the first woman president, and I want to barf on my own shoes because, with all due respect to recording, a vagina is not a qualification for being a president. As an example of how divided the town is, I'm across the street from Crystal's hotel right now, and this antique shop clearly supported Clinton Kane in the election. For Media Milwaukee, I'm Jamie Anderson.